Hi everyone, Helen here. In today's video, I'm going to be doing a wear test of Maybelline's Superstay Matte Ink Lipstick in their coffee edition. The shade I've chosen for today's wear test is Hazelnut Hypnotizer. I did do a swatch video on all the other colors in the coffee edition, so feel free to check that out. I'm going to apply the lipstick and wear it throughout the day, eat and drink as I would and see how it holds up. Okay, I have the lipstick on and I waited a full six minutes for it to set and dry. It was like watching paint dry or a pot of water boil. It took pretty long. It took me two coats to completely cover up the pigmentation on my lips. The lipstick has a matte finish and it's supposed to last for up to 16 hours but I'm not going to be wearing it for that long. Since the lipstick has set, I'm going to see if it's transfer proof. So there is a little bit of transfer but it's not too bad. I'm going to see how it holds up for the rest of the day. It is now 8.16. I'll check back in a couple of hours. It's now 12.01 and I just finished having a quick bite to eat. The lipstick is still looking intact. It looks good. There is still little to no transfer. I see a little bit of my lip outline coming off there. It looks like the lipstick is coming off towards the center of my lips as well. As for how the lipstick feels, it does feel a little bit tacky when I purse my lips together like this. You can see that my lips do stick together a little bit, so it's not like completely matte. I still feel a little bit of stickiness but that stickiness doesn't transfer. I usually don't like matte or liquid lipsticks because they make my lips dry, but right now the lipstick feels comfortable enough. Let's do a little close-up of the lips before the next check-in. I'll check back in a couple of hours. It is now 325 and the lipstick still looks pretty presentable to me. I think that this lipstick works great as a long wear option, but if you do take a look up close, you will notice that the lipstick does sink into all the crevices on my lips and upon closer inspection, it does look a little crackly. Let me take you outside into direct natural lighting so that you can see what it looks like out there. Overall, I'd say that this is a great long wear lipstick to have. If I were to become a flight attendant, again, this is the lipstick that I would buy and wear to work. It basically lasted throughout the whole day. I ate and drank as I normally would have. There was no feathering along my lip line and it is smudge and transfer proof. The only thing is, since this is a matte lipstick, it can be a bit drying. If you look at my lips close up and notice the little details, you see that the lipstick sunk into all the little crevices on my lips and it looks a bit crackly. That is going to be it for this video. Let me know down below what you think of lipsticks with a matte finish. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my next one. Did I get stung on my forehead? Lord!